Hello everybody, welcome to One More Week. Sejam muito bem-vindos a mais uma semana. Today we're going to make a a review sobre alguns temas que eu vi que vocês ficaram com um pouquinho de dificuldade, algumas dúvidas, ok? So, I'm going to do this video, ok? Se alguém ficar com alguma dúvida, deixa aqui nos comentários and then we're going to play a nice game, ok? So, things that I want to talk about. What we're going to talk? I want to talk about hours, ok? And some characteristic of animals. A gente vai passar bem rapidinho sobre todas elas. So, Let's talk about hours. Come on. So, guys, talking about hours. Remember, a gente falou sobre dois tipos de horário, as hours, ok? We said about whole clock, very good, and very good, half past, ok? Teacher, what is whole clock? What is half past? We always going to use whole clock. A gente sempre vai usar whole clock quando for uma complete hour, ok? 8 o'clock, 9 o'clock, 10 o'clock. You see? Tá vendo os double zero? Zero and zero. So, we're going to say o'clock. And half past. Sempre que tiver passado 30 minutes, ok? Metadinha aqui do relógio, 30 minutes, we're going to say half past. For example, very good. Repeat. Half past 10. Very, very good. What about this one? Ah, very good. Half past two, okay? So, this is o'clock and half past, okay? Repeat. Very good. O'clock, half past. Passou 30 minutes, half past. Hora completinha, o'clock. Very, very good. So, about hours is this, okay? Foi o que vocês tiveram mais dúvidas, about hours. So now we're going to see some things about animals, ok? Come on! Very good, guys! Pra gente não precisar voltar e falar sobre todos os animals, all the animals, I'm going to talk about the groups and the characteristics of each one. Que eu vi que vocês ficaram com um pouquinho de dúvidas. For example, os mammals. You see the mammals? Like the lion, the elephant. They born from the belly of the mommy, from the body, remember? They cannot be oviparous. All the mammals are very good. Viviparous. All the mammals are viviparous. Very good. Dentro dos mammals tem mammals herbivore, carnivores and omnivores. Ok? Então, esses três grupos tem dentro dos mammals. For example, the giraffe. Very good. Herbivore. Plants and fruits. Also come plants and fruits. The lion. Very good. Carnivore. What about the bear? Very, very good. O bear é omnivore. Ele come carnes, fruits and plants. Ok? Meat, fruit and plant. Very, very good. So, os mammals are viviparous. Ok? They're born from the belly of the mom. E tem todos os três. Herbivore, carnivore and omnivore. Ok? Teacher, what about the birds? Os birds that fly, ok? Os birds são oviparous. All the birds born from the... Very good, the eggs, ok? This is very easy. Todos os birds são oviparous. Dentro das categorias dos birds, a gente tem alguns que são carnivores, mas a maioria são herbivores, ok? Se alimentam de plants and fruits, ok? Lembra que eu falei... Os carnivores são aqueles maiores, like the eagles, the falcons, ok? Mas a maioria dos birds são herbivores. Very good. Repeat. Birds are herbivores. Very, very good. And ah, birds are oviparous. Todos os birds são oviparous. Very, very good. Agora tem uma category of animals, one group of animals, que foi o que vocês mais tiveram dúvida, que são os nossos little friends, <risos> os amphibians, amphibians, ok? Então vamos lá, first characteristic dos amphibians, todos os amphibians are oviparous or viviparous? E aí? Oviparous, viviparous? Oviparous, todos os amphibians are oviparous, ok? Não tem como ser amphibian and viviparous. Todos os amphibians are 
oviparous, all right? So, whose amphibians are oviparous, have wet skin, remember? Wet skin, quando tem a pele wet, pegajosa, right? Wet skin, and they live in the water, e uma parte da vida na terra. Os eggs ficam na water, eles se desenvolvem um pouquinho na water, e depois eles vão para terra, all right? To the land, ok? Very, very good. Now let's talk about the reptiles, all right? Os reptiles. Eu vi que vocês não tiveram muitas dúvidas, mas só para lembrar, tem como ser reptile and viviparous? No, todos os reptiles são oviparous, all right? They born from eggs, okay? And dentro dos reptiles a gente tem reptiles carnivore and we have reptiles herbivores, ok? Tem alguns que são carnivores, like the crocodile, the alligator, ok? E tem aqueles herbivores, like the chameleon, like the lizards, ok? So, reptiles, it's very, very easy. And the most easy, o mais easy de todos que a gente tem, o... <laughs> Os fish, very good. Fish, very, very easy. Fish, oviparous, viviparous. Very good. Os fishes são todos oviparous. They all born from eggs, ok? Fishes are oviparous. Repeat. Fish are oviparous. Very, very good. So, os fish have fins or legs? Huh? Fins or legs? Very good. Todos os fishes têm fins, ok? Remember, the whale and the dolphin They are not fish. The whale and the dolphin are mammals, ok? Eles vivem no ocean, but they are mammals, ok? A gente falou bastante sobre ele quando falou sobre os fishes. Whales and dolphins are mammals, ok? So, os fishes have fins. What about... Ah, the fish have skin like us or scales? Skin or scales? Very good. Repeat. Fish have scale. Very, very good. Fish have scale. Very, very good. E o último que eu vi que vocês também ficaram com dúvidas about the dragonfly. Remember dragonfly? Os insects. Os nossos little friends insects. Pay attention, guys. Dentro do grupo dos insects, tem alguns insects que são carnivores, ok? Eles comem outros insects, comem insetos maiores, ok? Alguns comem que chegam até a comer... Uh, reptiles, ok? So, os insects are carnivores, algum deles, mas the most big part of insects, they are herbivore, ok? A maioria dos insects are herbivore, alright? Alguns são carnivores, mas a maioria são herbivore, ok? A maioria dos insects are herbivores, alright? Very, very good. These are the groups of animals, all right? In these groups, we have vertebrate and invertebrate, okay? Vertebrate, animal that have spine, okay? Repeat, vertebrates have spine. Very, very good. Invertebrates don't have spine, repeat. Invertebrates don't have spine. Very, very good. So, guys, now that we've talked all about this, a gente já tinha visto esse conteúdo, ok? We are just reviewing this. A gente estava só dando uma revisada, ok? Eu vou deixar um game aqui embaixo com perguntas sobre esse assunto que a gente falou agora, right? About this, about ours, about the animals, ok? About animals in danger. Fazendo uma super revisão, um super game com todo o conteúdo que a gente já viu until today, ok? Então... Acessem o game aqui e deixem aqui quantas vocês acertaram daquele mesmo jeitinho. Quanto vocês erraram, quanto vocês acertaram, o que vocês acharam do game, ok? Vou deixar o link bem aqui embaixo. Have fun, ok? Se divirta em qualquer dúvida, any question, deixa aqui nos comentários. Alright? See you tomorrow. Bye, bye.